Hi guys, welcome to my channel. I am the Sylvia on a Nigerian YouTuber living in Onisha. If this is your first time tuning in, welcome and thank you so much for tuning in. And please just come to the subscribe button and hit the subscribe button. Do not forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified anytime I post a new video. And for my returning subscribers, I just want to say thank you. Thank you for coming back. Okay. Thank you so much. Okay. Guys, as you can see, I'm in a car. Okay. I plan to make a video. And as usual, you know how long it takes women to dress up. Today, we are going for child dedication and I was late as usual. So, hubby was threatening to leave me and go to the place. So, I had to just rush up my makeup and come with him then I now sat in the car to do the filming okay he's already inside where they are doing the child dedication but I decided to film because I have so many things in my mind that I want to let out last week I made a video about Awada and in that video I said some things like they don't have water like all these six story buildings don't have running water in depth. The impression that I created might be that there is no clean water. But even after I posted the video, people were commenting and I was going back to their pages to tell them like, no, I don't mean that they don't have water. They do have water. It's just that they don't have access to running water in their individual flats. And that is the truth. But then, people like the ones that grew up in our water, some of them, because some people say that I was saying the truth, but some we are angry. One even went to the extent of telling me that I am a liar. That's why my camera was shaking. It's in the comments. You can go and check it out. And the other person said I was condemning Awada. I don't have any reason to condemn any parts of Onucha. Okay? I've had bad experiences in Onucha, but I don't have any reason to start condemning a particular place. I am just saying the truth. If we decide to go to Awada now, to go and check if the things I said is true, believe me, you are, going, you are just going to go there and find out that 70% of the houses in Awada do not have access to running water in their flats. That is just the truth. And when the bad outweighs the good, do you expect me to come and lie to the public? Okay, maybe I'm not going to talk about it again. Or maybe if I'm filming, most of you are here just to see the places that you've not seen, okay? and i am happily doing that it's not as if i am not getting paid now yes but am i looking forward to get paid oh yes i love money and i'm not going to lie that maybe i'm not looking forward to the money i say okay as an evil girl i need the money more than anything i know i'm working towards something but i don't think that i should just go and start maybe misleading people it's something that I plan to do for a long time. It's not right now. Okay, if I come here and tell you that Awada is not overpopulated, Awada is not noisy, and somebody, after watching my video, now decides to move into Awada, the person will be like, this woman is a liar. And it's not fair. It's just going to tarnish my image. The people that are condemning me don't even know how much I love Onicha. Honestly, they don't know how much I love this city. This is the place of my bed. I can't come and start condemning the city. Eh? So, Bikun, you people are just making me feel like maybe quitting. Because I wouldn't want a situation where I would do a video. I will not put my voice. I will not use a voiceover. If I talk, maybe you will say that I lied. Okay, some of them that were condemning me in the video, did not even watch it till the end. At the end, I said that this place has access to electricity in fact in on each they can tell you that 23 hours a day that they have light this is one thing i can't even boast of in my area and i also said that you know what you don't like is something that some people cannot do without okay just like i said i don't like awada the people that are living there will tell me that they can't stay in any part of furniture because they like there that is just individual differences eh people know how eh i'm not trying to just you insult your place no now 
I grew up in Wallywe, Kulobia Street to be precise. And the day in Gageba, eh? All the nonsense in the media, I'm going to pour it out. I, I'm not I'm not that kind that normally has all these emotional attachments to something. Well, why now? Why will I have that attachment? If I keep quiet, the government will not know what is happening. Our governor can be everywhere at a point, okay? Maybe if one video goes viral, oh, people are talking about this, oh, this, can you see this? Maybe they can see it and decide to do something about it. You people, you don't want to even think about it. If this landlord in Awada saw that my Awada video, they'll feel like, oh, ha, see how people are feeling about this. So, and we are not putting water here. They can say, okay, let me just put my own water. Eh? I'm not saying that thing to insult Awada. Okay? I'm saying it's can make something about it because they need to do something about it. I could go that I didn't know my now. If we are all being emotional, Nandia will not do anything for us. We need change. Yeah, you cannot just be shouting change. Me, Rebe, Buari, no. Then when it comes to your landlord, you can't shout change. Can't see here now. Who is Become just understand where I'm coming from. Oh, I just decided to address this. Eh, that vibe. You people need to keep that vibe. Don't you maybe do this thing in our life. Okay. If you know where you where you need or where you want to see, you tell me. I go there and film it and post it for you. Eh, because don't start with it. Come on, this thing is paining me. That's why I decided to do this video. Eh? So, okay, you people should now suggest. Do you just want to see a video of the place without me talking about the place? Suggest, tell me, let me know what to do. Oh, people, I don't want my bum down. But let's understand each other. Oh, huh? so I want to thank you guys for coming back once again. And I want to say, stay with your girl. No, I love you. Just stay with your girl. Okay? Your girl is not going to disappoint. But you have to make the job easier for your girl too. Oh? Thank you so much. Mm. For the newbies, do not forget to hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so you'll be notified anytime I post any video. You know what I mean? Oh, I'm good. Oh, I'm good.